fame. Let's go. 15MOFE.com, Freshman Mondays. It's a family reunion. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we, yo, we, we had a first, like, know what I mean? Oh, we had a first on 15 behind the M- scenes was just kind of funny, scenes, man. Like, oh man, like, yo, you know, I don't even want to introduce myself right now. Like, I want to talk about this. Word. <laughs> like behind the scenes. First one. Let 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 let, 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 let them do that. Let them, yeah. First let them, one. Let them handle that. But uh, guess what? These two, look at them. Like, try to focus in. Like, try to focus in. Look at these guys. Cut it out. They look alike, right? They just found out they was cousins. Right here on 15MOFE.com. We bringing families together, yeah, y'all. Yeah, we bringing families together. Right here. Family and they said we wasn't yet. a family show. Like, yeah, for oh, real, man. man. Yo, it, yo, it was dope. You, you should have heard it. Like, yeah, I'm cousins with it. I'm her cousin, too. <laughs> she like, said, wait, Mokita? Yeah. <laughs> Say yeah. Like, say yeah. Like, yeah, that, that's my cousin. Oh, man. Yo, I hate, come to think about it, look at her edges. She got good hair, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can tell. She yeah, got good yeah, hair, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, chill yeah. Out, yeah. Oh, man. But, yeah, yeah. so yeah. for those who just tuned in. Bringing up family members, man. Like, yo, <laughs> come on, man. No new niggas, man. <laughs> <laughs> they old niggas already. Yeah, <laughs> right up, man. Oh, man. But, yo, yeah, so we back. Great. A breath fresh air entertainment, fresh from Mondays. We had each and every Monday, 8 to 10. I go by the name of First Wonder. Rum. The most spectacular man on internet radio. Y'all know how I do, Mr. 1080 KUI. And to my G- left. Your cousin. <laughs> <laughs> your cousin. <laughs> Copy. Like, oh, like, yeah. just, uh, just call it how, how it is, fam. Just, oh. just do it. Yeah, yeah, here's my family member, my cousin. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Introduce yourself to the people. Let them know who you Hello. are. My name is Charlie Box. I am a singer, songwriter, producer. I have written for Rihanna, Melanie Fiona, a few artists overseas, and I'm your cousin. <laughs> wow. <laughs> like, Yo, wow. You got to add that to the resume. Yes, yeah, like, yeah, exactly. So you got to put down the resume. Cousin of 15 MOFE host. First one there. Yo, that's tough, though. That's tough. Are you totally embarrassed now? Nah, I I just, it's crazy because. Like I said, when I looked at you and then I heard your voice and like you sitting here, they I'm didn't like, know each other. It wasn't until we sat Terrible. down and looked at each other like, wait a yeah. minute, Hold I know up. you from somewhere. Yeah, it's crazy. That's definitely crazy. Yo, they were sitting here really like reminiscing, like, yo, who key, your microphone is like far away from you. Yeah, yo, listen. He said, yo, they were sitting here like. <laughs> <laughs> yo, man, oh, nah, man. It, it was crazy, man. It's like, yo, we, I wish the camera was rolling, man. It was a very funny. It was, it was very funny, a great very moment. Funny. Oh, man. <laughs> but yeah, so can we uh, leave that alone for a little bit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll get back to you talking to your cousin. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? <laughs> 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 you don't want us talking to your cousin now? Uh, Is that what you're saying? No, nah, I'm saying. Oh, all right. Shouts to everybody in the chat right now. Um, Look, I'm about to chop some bright eyes up. Bright eyes in the chat said, uh, what's Grown ass men shouldn't wear mohawks. They can't uh-huh. hear you either. Your mic away from you. <laughs> Grown ass men shouldn't wear mohawks. Talking about some, I'm a loyal supporter. I figured I'd keep it real. I told her, that's not real. That's your opinion. <laughs> 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 now let's keep it real. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I mean, Long ass my bitch laughing. <laughs> what <laughs> you mean? <laughs> so. Oh, Impressive resume. Yeah, that's you really said, impressive. Yeah. Very. So let's talk about it. Like, how, how did you, like, what was your, f- well, let's talk about the Let's start. go all the way all back. All the way back. <laughs> like, yeah, all the way back before you knew First Wonder, you know, before y'all found out y'all was cousins, you know. Like, how, how did you get into the music? How did I get into music? Um, when I was younger, I never really thought I could sing. My mother was the one that was like, oh, my gosh, my baby could sing. I didn't really hear it. Um, I entered a few pageants when I was younger and started building my self-confidence. I wasn't really beat for singing like that, but, you know, eventually I was like, wow, I think I got a knack for this thing called music. Okay. Um, my cousin, which is Ray is dad. <laughs> <laughs> um, and for those who don't know who that is, Sugar Ray of Double yes, X Posse. Yes, Double X Posse. Not going to be able to do yes. it. Can we do it? <laughs> yeah, y'all know about Jersey City Zone. Yeah. yeah. Um, he is my first cousin, and I think I was really inspired by him. You know, I was in the studio well, actually, before I even entered the studio, he was like, you know, Shaw, you should start writing some of your own songs. And it never really dawned on me. I used to write stories, crazy stories all the time. But 
until he said it, it was like, yeah, okay. So I started just writing the break beats, and that's how it began. Okay, so uh, what kind of stories would, would you write? Were you like Shane? No, it was definitely <laughs> not Shane. What's that book all the girls read? Uh, Sh- Fifty Shades of Grey? Oh, no, it wasn't like oh, okay. that. Okay. No, okay. <laughs> it was just, I guess, stuff like, you know, creative writing. Nothing in particular, poetry, stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. Oh, let me, let, me get, let me get a quick uh, 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 sample of the poetry. Okay. Let me get, let me get a quick one. <clears throat> Black girl, black girl, you are the world. No, I don't write poetry like that. <laughs> Phenomenally. Yeah. Right. Phenomenal woman. Phenomenal woman. That's that me. is me. <laughs> oh, my. But, yeah, so, so you started off. So when did you decide that you were going to take this serious? Um, I think I took it seriously. Once I started winning stuff, <laughs> once okay, I started okay. winning competitions, I was like, well, hey, I might be able to really sing here. Okay. Uh, as I was getting older and I continued to write for myself, uh, that's when, you know, we were shopping my demo and a few executives started hearing my songs. And, of course, the loyalty was to the artists that were already signed to the company of that, course. you know, of course. were shopping and stuff too. So they were like, oh, wow, we really like this song. So, you know, me with the entrepreneurial spirit that I have, I was like, well, you know, okay, I songwriting, I guess that's for me. You know, I guess everybody has alternative mm-hmm. talents. Yeah. So I explored that and I continued to write. And when I met my writing partner, Curtis Richardson, I think that's when we really, really started going in with songwriting because we were just writing all the time. Nice, nice. Yeah. So on your resume, you got Rihanna. Yes. You got Melanie Fiona. So how, how did Can those you tell us about? what songs? Yeah, absolutely. On yeah. Rihanna, Final Goodbye, and it's on her uh, Girl Like Me album, nah, I know number that. six. I know that song. Oh, you do? Yeah. How's you it go? That? I wrote it. How's it go? I can't come up with right off the top of my head. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, you're in the wrong we, we, parade. We, 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 we listen. We listen. <laughs> yeah, you saying. might be in the wrong parade if you, <laughs> you start singing that. Yeah. <laughs> That, that's how I'm a good, you know. Well, that, that sounds a little like it. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, you know. Oh, my goodness. Try and put Monday morning spot. for Melanie Fiona. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Yes. So, so how, did I, how did that come about? Like, Well, without making it a long story, because it could totally no, make be it a long, long story. story. Okay. Do, that. do that. We here. Okay. It's well, your story. There's people that make don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, people don't know. Okay. Well, for Final Goodbye, it started off just as a demo. We were just writing a song. Uh, I was working with um, a producer by the name of Luke McMaster, and we actually produced it as well, myself and my writing partner and um, my production partner. I'm sorry. Uh, he was playing this really cool lick on his guitar, and I was like, damn, that sounds really, really nice. And honestly, lyrics just started falling out of the sky. Like, mm-hmm. And I even put that in the, a portion of the song, yeah. you know, spell out the lyrics of love in the sky. Uh, and the song just came together like in a few minutes, honestly. Wow. I just kind of conjured up Romeo and Juliet, that whole moment, and I wrote the song about that. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. We were working with an artist out of Toronto at the time, and we shopped her demo to uh, Def Jam. And mm-hmm. uh, they loved the song. He passed on the girl, and that's how it happened. Just like that with Rihanna, wow. with Rihanna placement. Uh, Melanie Fiona is a little more interesting, a little more personal with that story. Um, I was just um, on the heels of ending uh, a deal. I won't get into all that, yeah. but uh, you know, just uh, situation. And I, I was feeling some kind of way about music. Yeah. Like you know, we kind of yeah, go in yeah, and out. Yeah, you know, yeah, I'm yeah. just being real here. Yeah. You know, It'd being be a like musician that. and an artist. You, you put your heart and soul into this thing. Mm-hmm. So I was feeling some kind of way about music. I wasn't really sure if I wanted to, you know, continue. And I got a phone call from a producer, uh, Peter Wade, and he asked me, he said, hey, you want to join us in, you know, set on this session next week? And I really wanted to say no. I'm like, oh, it's not be for, you know, yeah. doing yeah. a song right yeah. now. I wanted to take a little break. Um, wound up saying yes, went in the studio, wrote the song Monday morning about exactly how I felt. At that moment, like I just wanted to get I on. I love a, that it got Monday in it. Yes, why? Yeah. I hate like Monday. What's today? I love Monday. First Monday. Yeah, 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 then that's yeah, gonna yeah. have to be your theme song. Yeah, Monday it night. Might, it might have Monday, to. Monday night. night. Like it has to be that. There you go, Al. There you go. Yeah, you know, <laughs> she's about to write a jingle for us. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, we got the background. We missed Monday morning. Take that song. We missed Freshman Monday. Send it in. That's going to be our new. We're going to do what the white boys did to Five Heartbeats. We got no Wow. Ain't got no fancy cars. Jack. You got a comment in the room. Very from, pretty. From oh. Bright Eyes. Bright Eyes says she's very, very pretty. Very pretty. Oh, thank you, Bright Eyes. I'm skeptical eyes. about saying that because she looked just like, like my boy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You can't even, you can't even do that now. Everything's just changed. <laughs> Are you going to take it personal? <laughs> Are you going to take it personal? Yeah, you. Nah, like, nah, I mean, yo, that's my cousin. Yeah, that's yo. my cousin. You only knew for five minutes. Let her. You only knew for five minutes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yo, that's that's my cousin though, yo. You can't. Oh, yo, you don't be talking to her like that. So, back to you. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, what one thing you said? You talked about how the deal ended, and you didn't want to, you know, really be involved in music. Mm-hmm. Do you feel like, uh, like the music business is a little shady sometimes? Hmm. I mean, I, I love. Music. Yeah. I don't necessarily love the business of music mm-hmm. because there's no real, you know, I, I feel like the music business is an industry where it's just kind of like any and everybody's like, yeah, I, I'm into music. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? It's the underworld. Well, yeah, well, yes it's and no. Underworld. It's cool. <laughs> it's what it's you cool. make it. It's definitely yeah. what you make it. If you, you surround it. yourself around people with integrity and people with morals and mm-hmm. standards, it can be a nice experience, yeah. you know? But I mean, uh, when you run into those people, that's when you really start learning lessons. Oh yeah. About the industry. Fam- so, Ooh, yeah. Blood sucking, they're, they're necessary. They're yeah. necessary. They're necessary. Yeah, it's, it's part of the experience, I guess. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Well, it can be very Absolutely. discouraging. It can be if you allow it to be. Yeah. I feel like in my life, I've I've really, really made it my purpose and just to separate my personal life and my business life. Mm-hmm. So when I go home, I take off. The Charlie Vox hat, and I'll put on the, you know, girl next door hat. Okay. So I can just debrief from the industry. Yep. Mm-hmm. So where would you like to be in in this industry? Where would I like to be in this industry? I'd like to be wherever God wants me to be, and I know that's, that probably sounds real corny, but yeah, was that was very political. That was, <laughs> it was kind of corny. It was kind of, it was kind of corny. It was kind of corny. I'll tell you why, though. Okay. I'll tell you why because right. I I feel like for so uh, for a lot of people, you know, we have this this idea of what we'd like it to be, and that's with anything in life. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like that's what oh, we want to know. Though. Here, I want to be. <laughs> That's what we want to know. What I would know, you like it to be? I, I'd like to just, I want to be happy. What you want you know God what to give you? I would love <laughs> 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 What did you, right, pray, well, for? you, yeah, yeah, what did you pray for? Yeah, yeah. What did you Let's get to that. The meat and potatoes. The meat and potatoes. Um, you know, I just want to, I want to be legendary. I want people to look back on my career and say, wow, she did that. You know, I, mm. I'd really like to just, I'd like to be like her. And in being like me, that means just persevering because I never stopped. You know, I've been told no a lot. But I never stopped. Y'all just got this burning desire to just keep on going. And to me, that's the race is already won. Yeah. Do y'all hear her voice just talking? Yeah. She got a singing voice. Like she, <laughs> yeah, like it's, it's, it's borderline <laughs> angelic. Like She's oh. singing like I she, think like when you <laughs> die and go to heaven, she's going to be the one like, no, walk walk to the left. She's going to be like, oh. Who are you? Hell. That's hell. She's like, <laughs> like, Charlie. Oh, all right. Charlie's Angels. <laughs> hey, word, word. Charlie's Angels. There you go. Yeah, that was tough. Oh, my God. Yeah, that was tough. That was she tough. got so one of them voices. The whole name, Random Acts of Charlie. Um, you know, Charlie Vox, Random Acts of Charlie. What is the name? Well, I'm Charlie Vox. Okay. And my band is Random Acts of Charlie. Okay. Yes. Okay. It's all about reinvention. The band. They, yes, cool, the they band. cool with having your name in their band? Yeah. They I'm like leader, you like I'm that? I'm the leader of the band. They like oh. you like I that? I put the band together. You the Eminem? <laughs> <laughs> I'm the Eminem. Okay. <laughs> so talk about the band. Well, I have a ten piece band. Okay. Damn. There are well it's really nine pieces. I'm the, the tenth piece. Yeah, yeah. Um we have a drummer, bass player, guitar, three horns, um wow. two other background singers. And we just like to jam out. Do they yeah. all share the same love for the music that you do? Yes they do. Yes they do. How hard was it to find these people? Oh, it wasn't difficult. I come from band culture. So I, I know a few musicians, so it was pretty easy just, you know, choosing, picking and choosing. I just picked the, the most soulful people that I know. Mm. <laughs> awesome. awesome. I, you so, know, yeah. I noticed, you know, because um, <clears throat> I've been in groups and been in groups of people working in music. Mm-hmm. Sometimes, you know, this person can't do it. Their priorities isn't it. How mm-hmm. tough is it to keep that team together and, you know, get together all in one place at one time to get things done? 
Well, I mean, it's pretty easy right now. Okay. Um, we haven't had too much trouble with that. Um, we're setting up a tour schedule, so very soon you'll be able to, you know, come out and see us perform. Um, I mean, every now and then you may have to have a sub here, a sub there. Mm -hmm. But, you know, once again, when you know so many amazing musicians, you know, it's, it's pretty easy to just kind of say, hey, you available? You know, to kind of interchange. But we have a pretty set band. Gotcha. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Well, we got some music for my right? Yeah, hey. we have um, some some uh, Charlie Vox music. Yeah, um, I like Charlie Vox music. Charlie yeah. <laughs> I, I, I like, like the music too. I like Charlie Vox just I'm talking. Yeah, I like Charlie <laughs> Vox music too. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Every time I call Verizon or you know a phone company or something, <laughs> they should have you pick up. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be pissed off like, motherfucker, oh, cut my phone off again. Yeah. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, nah, y'all, y'all yeah, cut my phone off. It's alright though. I don't even need a phone. Five hundred eighty-two dollars. I don't even, I don't even need a phone. <laughs> yeah, you heard her? She just yeah, so yeah, she got the poetic justice. <laughs> How much is it? How much is it? Three thousand five hundred eighty-two dollars to turn your service back on. Um, no, I don't, I don't think I need my service back on. But you know, um. <laughs> Yeah. It's alright though. What's your name? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, y'all niggas ever try to holler at the chick? <laughs> <laughs> I did that shit a lot. <laughs> oh man! Hey, yo, anybody else, son? I remember. Yeah, I call the business and the chick sound nice. I'm like, nah, but what's your name? <laughs> well, I'm be nah, looking up no, on Facebook like while she's talking. What's like, your name? Like, what's your last like, name? Sound like you? Are you in North nah, Carolina? Nah, I, 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 I'm borderline stuck. Nah, I'm just saying. Like, I, I, man, I, I, I think if they look uh, good, you sound like you fat. <laughs> like yo, it's like they have amazing voices. <laughs> yo, yeah, yo, big stuff. girls have amazing voices. Yo, yeah, oh, you know this? Thank y'all. I'm serious. I mean, I'm like yo, you. Alright, maybe you should make. <laughs> Fifteen I don't know. Fresh from Monday. You know, I, I, I'm coming with my stereotypes today, man. I'm coming <laughs> with them. I'm coming with them. All we, right, but we here each and every Monday, eight to ten. Um, so we got some uh, Charlie Vox. I ain't, I ain't calling y'all a bitch girl. I ain't calling y'all a bitch girl. Yeah, 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 you know, I'm just saying. Would you consider yourself a big girl? I mean, I, I'm definitely she's not, not small. You think? Yeah, I'm oh, a little she's on the thick side. She's not big. She's nice thick. She's thick. not big like he talking big. Nah, she's not. Yeah, I know what you talking she about. Ain't, she ain't yeah, fat yeah, girl yeah, thick. Yeah, 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 she's yeah, yeah. thick. talking swamp donkey. Like, <laughs> like, Damn, what is I don't know. All right, I'm part. Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. Charlie Vox. All the opinions of Key. Yeah, right? Yeah, you know. Look, random acts of Charlie and opinions of Key. Word. Go for it. That's his new mixtape. He's not a rapper. <laughs> Featuring Ralph. <laughs> shirt's coming soon, too. Yeah, that's Ralph's favorite line. He's been saying that for like two years. Yeah, the shirts ain't oh. never come yet. <laughs> I mean, I think there's, a, there's a couple people in the chat room that like you, too. She's very pretty. Oh, She's yeah, right fly as hell. Thank yeah. you. Frankie Frank Frank in there. That. That he's in there. He's in there. He ain't there watching. He's the engineer. He, 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 he guys, you. Yo, she came with a bodyguard. <laughs> oh, man. He got a brand on his own. What's that, Iota? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, nah. He, he came with Army Fatigue. Oh, he a Sigma. Yeah. Like, oh, he yeah. Sigma. No. Like, nah. He got like, the brand. <laughs> nah, he, Boy, he got a like bodyguard here. Like he throw be he bells of hay and shit. <laughs> what? Well, it's a show full of guys. I'll be there. Yeah. <laughs> what? The construction on too. So all those dudes. Yeah, all of them suck. dudes. Yeah, all right. I'm coming with you. Fuck that. And he goes in the mirror practicing like, what you say, Nick? Nah, nah, I, I mean, like he that. comfortable now since y'all cousins. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't good. Like, oh, he, he was hitting you hard. That's on Instagram? Oh, they he emailed you? <laughs> he emailed you too? Y'all got my face hurting. Oh, yeah. Well, they comfortable, comfortable now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He emailed you? <laughs> From his personal email? <laughs> he ain't got a radio email like, yeah, or nothing? You should see, yeah, you should see how he eased up. Like, I mean, like, like Yo, hold on, that's... he about to come on. Like, oh, y'all cousins? <laughs> right. He laid back. Like, <laughs> <laughs> on the phone. Like, <laughs> like I ain't paying Nah, nigga, y'all ain't even got to come for this one. Uh, <laughs> oh, my goodness. They family. Uh, mm -mm. He started filming this shit. Like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at them. They look like ah. Uh, yeah, he stopped texting. Uh, 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 <laughs> one a day, one a day, one a day. That's what we do on Fresh and Look, he said that nigga got good hair. Ah, uh, <laughs> <laughs> we good. <yeah. laughs> oh, you guys are crazy. About yeah. to play some Charlie music. Yeah, we about to play some Charlie music. Uh, also about your voice. Um, mm -hmm. I seen that in your bio on Twitter that you was the voice of Vivo. Yes, hot this week. What? Mm -hmm. Vivo hot this week. Yes. Uh, first of all. People have videos I didn't even know. I swear on I YouTube. Didn't know that. And I'm just sitting here listening to your voice. Like, you could do anything. And People just... have videos on YouTube. But to get on Vivo, there's a certain criteria, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. So, talk about that. So, well, every week I go in for a weekly wrap-up show. It's an entertainment show. And we talk about 
was hot this week. So last week, if I remember correctly, it was Taylor Swift, uh, this Mahone kid, uh, uh, Adrian Mahone, I yeah, believe. Yeah, I heard of him. And um, there's a few other shows that are on Vivo as well. Okay. Like the comment show with David So, he's a comedian, and he kind of mm. cracks on people on YouTube that say stupid things. Mm. And there's also a show called Lyric Lines, where this kid named Tommy goes around, and he sings song lyrics to girls to try to pick them up. So that's mm. what I talk about every week. Wow. Sing song lyrics to girls try to pick him up. Is that the right. white boy that be rapping while he's singing? No, well he's not really rapping. This guy oh, is just right. kind of like, I don't know. Think of a song, a neo song. Yeah, no, nah, he was singing. Yeah. He was singing rap song. He was singing yeah, DMX. Be, right, it'll be a song. So he yeah. was singing DMX. I heard so he'd be like, girl, he's, it's so easy to love me now. Would you love me if I was down? And now, <laughs> so I can't get that number. And then Word. like like that. He's like. <laughs> I, you know, somebody the hood, somebody got the up there and sung a, sung a biggie joint at the jazz fest this weekend. I was like, "What the heck is Oh wow! Doing? It was corny though. <laughs> but, Don't say that. They, they, I, 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 I thought it was my opinion. Opinions of wonder. The opinions of wonder, y'all. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was fine. Bright eyes gave an opinion talking about my mohawk. Fifteen more feet dot com. Like Mondays. that. <laughs> We're about to get into some Charlie Vox music. Yeah, uh, what you want to get into? Let's do You Should Let Me Love You. You Should Let Me Love You. Yeah. Let's, let's get into uh, the tool. Let's get into the tool. Yes. That's the video. Can we, can we get into the no, let's, let's do that so we can end <laughs> with one. Yeah. Can we do that? Oh, we got. We're going to uh, we pace ourselves. Gonna, she's pushing these two. All right. So let's All ride right. these two. So oh, let's okay. get into the video, You Should Let Me Love You. It was filmed in Jersey City? Yes. Downtown. Downtown Jersey City. Yes. Let's get into that. <laughs> Ain't none of us in it? No. Oh. Uh, Wait, you're from Jersey City? Yeah. She's from Jersey City. And y'all don't know each other. Oh, oh my God. God. No, we, no, we, crazy. No, we <laughs> know each other. We just didn't. I haven't seen him in yeah, so long. Like, yeah, nah, it's probably cool. like yeah. Skyline. Uh, right. When I lived on Skyline. He was probably like that 10 years like, old yeah. last time I saw him. Long Same face, though. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. So anyway, let's get into that. Charlie Fox, Random Max and Charlie, You Should Let Me Love You on 15MOFE.com. Freshman Mondays. We'll be back. Let's go. <laughs> 15 MOFE.com Freshman Mondays. Yep, yep. That was uh, the video. You should yeah. let me love you. Let by me Charlie love Fox. you. Yeah, man. What do y'all think, man? Put it in the chat. Let us know what y'all think. Um, do that. You know, we want to know. One to five. What you think? One to five. One to five. What do you think of the Charlie Fox? You should let me. One love being you. the best. Nah. <laughs> 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 one being the worst. <laughs> five being the best. <laughs> It should be one being the, yeah, being the I, best. Yeah, I always said that. I always said that. Why, that's why, why I named myself First Wonder because, you know. Like, yeah, it's like, who, who wants to be number five? Yeah. Like, who wants to be number ten? So we want to switch it up today? Hey, no, I mean, we can do it, but <laughs> I'm just saying. It's like, we ain't going to go with the format, with the regular format. Regular format. We're, 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 we're five being the best. People. Five being the best. One being the worst, unfortunately. But, yeah. But, yeah, well, we got to do that, man. It's like, yeah, it's like, everybody wants to be number one. Nobody wants to be number five. No, nobody wants that. Like, I mean, so, I agree. You know, one should be the best. So it's your boy Rum. <laughs> I go by the name of First Wonder, the most spectacular man on internet radio. Y'all know how I do, Mister Ten Eighty K U I. All right, yeah. And um, we got some questions from the chat too. Uh, let me get back to that. Um, Bright Eyes, she's a very loyal supporter of ours. Tunes in um, almost every show. Yeah, every Bright show. Eyes. And um, who doesn't like my um, my mohawk? Apparently, <laughs> and she always also said she was pretty. Um, Thank you. She said, wait, where is it? Where is it? She said she saw you. Um, she read that you opened up for Destiny's Child. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Wow. <laughs> okay. So How long ago was that? Yeah. Ooh. So she said, who would, <laughs> well, who would you love to open up? Destiny's who, Child haven't been together for a while. Who would you love to open uh. up for her? One? Who would you love to open up for you one oh, day? Oh, that's a good question. Okay, that's I love that question. <laughs> right eyes might need to come up here. Yeah, she, she be asking yes. some shit sometimes. Yeah, nice little co-host, right? Yeah. Bright eyes, let's set that up, bright eyes, because you, 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 you be going hard. Yeah. Going hard. Who would I like to open up for me? Can I get back to that? <laughs> yeah. Sure. I really want to think about that. I really want to give a good answer. And Jackie said that's a good question. I think she just got off the road from singing background for Estelle. Yes, yeah. I Look sure did. I yeah. sure did. Dope. So who, who would you like to work with or open up for like or what is your ideal situation just to give us a, what's what's ideal for you hmm. there are a few people in the industry i'd like to work with i always wanted to work with timberland i thought he was okay he's just bananas Miss, yeah, yeah yeah he's crazy um i had the opportunity to sing with john legend like that was Cool. Whoa. That was really oh. surreal. Yeah, yes, he, he, right. does, he does a great impression <laughs> can we get that live it's not better than mine oh. yes. it's not better than mine 
Let well, me get some. Let me get some. Oh, 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 oh. Sheesh. <laughs> <laughs> Should have went first, yo. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. So, I'm about to save you a little bit. I'm going to save you. I'm about to talk about his, <laughs> his pants now. <laughs> I'm going to save you. Do, do, do the parody version. Here we go. I ain't doing none of the versions, man. <laughs> how, do you, how, do you, how do you come after that? Of course. <laughs> Tell a joke. <laughs> do a joke. Why the chick across the road? No, the parody joke. Of John Legend. Nobody? Nobody's going to ask me why another night? Why? why the chick across the road? Let's go to the next segment, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. Wow, dude. Did you start? Did you, did you shut Rum down? Huh? Did she shut you down, Rum? <laughs> I'm kind of in the middle of something right now, too. Oh, all right, but, um, all right. <laughs> yeah, or in the I'm, middle of a radio show. Okay. Nah, yeah, now nah, I'm doing some important shit, though. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah, now nah, it's a little bit more important than the radio show. I think what? I, I, th- I think I talked about it earlier. You know. But, um, nigga, keep going, motherfucker. <laughs> worry about me now. Nigga, this ain't me. Uh, this is about uh, Charlie. You killed my vibe. Jack, Murder. Jack, Jackie <laughs> says she didn't know about the John, John Legend collab. Yeah, yeah. Oh, That's yeah. Dope. I'd Hopefully. love to collab with him. It was almost surreal. Like he was teaching us this vocal part. Yeah. And I was like, oh my God, John Legend is teaching me the the <laughs> soprano part to this song. It was I was bugging out. I was about uh, to jump out of my skin. So like uh, how did that come about? You, well, you it was when I was performing with Estelle. When okay. I was doing backgrounds with Estelle, mm. they have a song oh, together. Oh, Estelle, okay. <laughs> she, 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 it's like it, the, the list keeps growing. <laughs> as she keeps talking. Yeah, yeah that was a really cool experience. Dope. She works very, very hard. Oh. I mean, I don't, I don't know if she, if she knew that I was watching her the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> well, um, some, uh, some stuff just came in from the chat. Um, bright eyes gave you a ten, ten, ten. Aww. She said she feeling the song. I like bright eyes. Yeah, um, she gave you a ten out of five. <laughs> yeah. I used to like bright eyes before she said something about my mohawk. <laughs> <laughs> I liked bright eyes. <laughs> oh man! And the cast dead. said um, song was hot. Dang. Energy reminds me of Mary J, one of my favorite artists. Great voice. Awesome! Thank you so much. So, Thank you. Uh, yeah. So you only get this kind of stuff love, on man. Freshman Mondays. Get this kind of love on Freshman Mondays. Y'all should have me back so I can have thirty minutes of fame. Uh, well, you, you I'm more, tired of you. you. Over 15. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I think you're actually oh, oh, man. Tired of your cousin oh, one day. Yeah, yeah, that's some family. Yeah, that's some cousin. family shit right there, right there. You, it's like, all right, y'all related. That was some shit you would say too. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, y'all I want thirty minutes. Yeah, like, you know that's times two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to bring me back. <laughs> like, you got to have me on every track <laughs> on your, your album. Like, <laughs> Like, I don't know I if you know, know, but I do music too. I, oh, I didn't see, know that. see, see, like, yo, I want to so get a studio involved. with you and John so, Legend. Because they was making a joke, so I, I just figured I'd let you know what they I did not know to. that. Rum does music. We have FO2 oh, okay. Music Group. Rum got. That's yeah. good to know. <laughs> <laughs> We're on, we've so been on a little hiatus, but we. we, we so so you've been on it. I've been on a hiatus. <laughs> I've been working. And they've been, they've been working. So you okay. get him? I'm working under the roof. Uh, so he he wants a feature since and now since your cousin uh, like he he wants a plug. We gonna have I to actually, work something out. I actually have the perfect record off of Rum's album. I'm on it. He's on. Oh, that's hot. Yeah. So we definitely got to talk. Yeah. yeah, and it's light work too. Do that. Something you could do like. That's what's up. That's what's up. Let's do that. Yeah, you know it's what I'm on air. About? This is this is a uh, this no, is a yeah, this, agreement, this is bonding. <laughs> you know yeah. I will sue you your know. ass if you ain't on my list. You know what record I'm talking about, right? No, I don't. Tunnel vision. Tunnel vision. Vacant. Oh yeah, no, that's dope. This, remember that? Like, yeah, part I, I told you I want that. Yeah, this is bonding yeah. right here. Okay. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, but yeah. but anyway, you know I just dropped the second verse on that, right? Uh, yeah. You, did you hit? You heard? Uh, she heard told me about it. Heard the newer are, are one. Y'all serious? <laughs> all right, serious? all right, back to yeah, yeah, y'all serious? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. oh, y'all could have talked amongst yourselves. We we was doing. Yeah, something we just having a conversation. We want to turn turn our mics off. No, I'm just playing. Pause. <laughs> but um, <laughs> <laughs> shouts to uh, everybody in the chat right now. We got um fire seventy two in the chat. We have, um, is that Beast Mode? Beast Mode H. Yeah, Cass, Bright Eyes, Jackie. Oh, I never answered Bright Eyes' question. Frankie. Oh. Who would I like to open for me? You ready? Yes. But I don't know. This answer might be corny. Nah, do you? Don't say God. No. Oh, <laughs> that was your other corny answer. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Whoever God wants me to be. I want Jesus I want to an open. angel to open up for me. <laughs> Angel with the harp. No. <laughs> Give me Jesus. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No, but honestly, everybody I admire right now has such a big name. I don't know. It'd be, like, but we, that'd be you, so your name's bigger. Be like, your name's bigger. Wow, so nah, what? It's okay. Do your thing. This, 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 this is your moment. This is yours. If God my gave you moment. what you wanted, who would open up for you? Oh, my goodness. 
Beyonce. No, nice. I'm joking. <laughs> Whoa. Nice. Nah, 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 nah. That's, that's dope. dope. It's like, so that means no, you're going to no, be no, no, past no. Beyonce. Listen. Yeah, that's all that means. That doesn't mean she's bad. No, I Beyonce's guess. amazing. Yes. The, yeah. Any artist that I name, I'd definitely be opening up for them right now. Okay. Yeah. But, you know. <laughs> but, it, it, but Beyonce, happens. who else? Let's let's get three. Let's get uh, three. Out. It happens. Wu Tang really, opened up for. I, 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 I love Rihanna. <laughs> Kendrick I love Lamar. Rihanna. Not Rihanna. Just, yeah, not even just Beyonce. I, Rihanna. Um, who else do I love a lot? Let me name a guy. Kendrick Lamar. I really like Kendrick nice. Lamar. He's yeah. dope, right? Yeah. But they're definitely not opening acts at all. Nah. So. What do you think about um, Life Genesis? This, this is my personal question. I don't even care what y'all want to hear. But um, Life Genesis. I like Life Jennings. Life. He's, he's dope. Cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, life. Life's dope. dope. That, that, that's who I want to work with. Yeah, he's dope. I would do a track with Life. I think huh? he's very, very creative. Anthony yeah. Hamilton. Yes. Yeah. Soulful so yes. people. Yeah, Charlene, like I, I like that song, Charlene. Yeah, that, that, he's dope. <laughs> he's dope. It's a lot of underground um, R&B artists, too. Yeah. But, um, well, if you didn't know, 15 Minutes of Fame Radio is one of our taglines. is where the opening act is the headliner. Oh. Yeah. So this is your moment. That's dope. Yep, I yeah, like that. Well, it, I know you heard the topic earlier. Early. Get into, oh yeah, for the people who oh. did, who did. what am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> like I'm on, like I'm on Instagram, path to all that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, for the people who don't, yeah. who just tuned in, shots to fire. Actually, put a comment. Um, said uh, song is hotness. You should let me love you, Charlie. Is a like, so that's pretty dope. Thank yeah. you. But um, <laughs> yeah, for those who just tuned in, we was talking about the Puerto Rican Day Parade earlier. No new friends. And um, how the two chicks was together, and mm-hmm. then um, you gonna cue that picture up, HD? Let me know when it's up. Oh, it's already up. And um, they was two together, and then eventually they ended up fighting. And the result was pretty bad. And um, it was so interesting. I saw this this morning. It was oh, a very yeah. I was about to show you. I didn't know if you've seen it. <laughs> it very and interesting. And I saw the uncensored one. So. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, crazy. I heard it was over $100. I heard that they off- somebody offered them $100 to fight each other. Mm-hmm. And I guess they agreed. <laughs> I don't know how they agreed, but that was the result. And, you know, it came to my, my head, and I was thinking about it. I'm like, Drake got this whole No New Friends movement, right? Mm-hmm. And um, everybody running around saying, no new friends, my circle's tight, da 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 You know, um, how do you feel about the whole no new friends movement? You, hmm. you think it's a certain point where you just stop letting friends in, stop meeting, not necessarily meeting people, but just cutting, cutting off saying, ah. Well, I used to feel like that mm-hmm. until I started meeting amazing people. And mm. I was like, I don't know if I should be cutting off everybody. Uh-huh. There is a circle that I have. I, most of my close friends, I've known them for like, like 15 plus years. Okay. Um, so I don't know. I think n- no new friends, but I mean, you could probably work toward uh, new friendships. Uh-huh. You know, I don't think anybody's just your friend just out the gate. Like, oh yeah, I met her last week. That's my friend. The new acquaintances, maybe. Exactly. I was then, raised in your lifetime. You're only gonna have a handful, a handful of friends. Of friends. Yeah. So it's you like, fingers, it's like right. you got five fingers. If Absolutely. you got more than five, if you got more than five, there's a problem. Right. Yeah, there, there is a problem. So well, I mean. People could grow to be your friends, though, I, and the people could grow nope. out to be your friends. Absolutely. Nope. It's like, yo, I have, certain, yo, when, I have more than five friends that I can call in, in an emergency situation. I mean, they're, they're, they're good people. Mm, I don't know. I, I, I Maybe think, like seven. A good yeah, seven friends yeah, I can call you, up. You got like, girl, girl, help me. Yeah, I, 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 I don't know. I, I think uh, you, it's like, I really think you have, you probably got like two good friends, and then you got all the other ones that, that will help you. Like well, they, they'll they'll just be they'll they'll be around they'll they'll be good influences, but there's only gonna be like one or two that are really really like, yeah, almost family. Mm-hmm. Where you consider them, where you can say like they're almost family, like that's your blood, that's your sister, or you know, mm-hmm. that's that's my opinion. Right, right, right. You know, it, it's like from my experiences, you know. No new niggas for me. <laughs> <laughs> it is no new niggas. I mean, it's like I mean we'll be cool. It's like I, I I have no problem getting cool with people, but it's, again, I'm not like inviting you into my circle. Right, like, right. Certain, right. certain circles. It definitely takes time to yeah. invite people into your circle, but yeah. you can work on new friendships. I think it's cool to I meet believe. I, I think after a certain age, you you can't do it. Yeah, it's like <laughs> after a certain age, like yo, once you like past like 25, 26, it's like you know you. I think it's younger than that, bro. I think at like seventeen, like that's it. Nah, 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 nah. Seven, yeah, Like yeah, it's, it people. might be, it might be about twenty one, twenty two. So after that, it's. Mm, that might I might be a wrap for that. But. My writing and production partner at around, I think I was like maybe twenty two, twenty three. See, Something but like but that. do you think? He, but do you think he, he's your but friend? He's, 
Is, is he your friend because he's your friend, or is he your friend because he's work? your partner? No, he's definitely my friend because he's my friend. So that's yeah, what I'm saying. People could grow to be your friends until like, you loan him four hundred dollars <laughs> because he can't handle <laughs> oh, his um boy. finances. Oh, no. And then I'm let sorry. me tell you, I'd loan him four hundred dollars, and I wouldn't even care about seeing it back. That's she's a real friend. That's a I friend. Know. <laughs> <laughs> but you're not my friend. No new friends. See, oh. <laughs> <laughs> he shut you down. Oh, <laughs> She got her seven. She's not 22. Uh, she, not 22 she got her seven. <laughs> and you won the cousin. Uh, yeah. <laughs> then plus the guy over here, he, he going to stomp you out. <laughs> oh, DJ. <laughs> My boy over there, boy. Yo, I can't wait he to... looked like he was in every Stomp the Yard movie. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga ripped, though. He over there like, yeah, I wish a nigga would say something. Uh, <laughs> say something, nigga. <laughs> Nah, he's cool, dude. He back on the phone, though. He, he yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's why he waiting. Word, he like, yo, that, that, that dog skin nigga at the end look like he got yeah, a, The mohawk? With the mohawk. <laughs> he look like he got a knife. He got a mohawk, so I know y'all got no gun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, yeah shouts to um, Fire said, are we going to hear Try Again? And, uh, you know, so just let him know we closing the show with that. And then Fire also said... Charlie got a great personality. Great, incredible, has an incredible that. personality. Oh, thank you. Bright, Bright eyes said, Charlie seems like she's always happy and full of life. I sense that. I try. I try to be happy. It must run in your family. This this guy, he's like that. <laughs> Except for when he's sad. Like, you know. <laughs> 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 oh, man. <laughs> These guys. See? See what I deal with? Yeah. But then he's back yeah. happy and like I don't even need them as friends. <laughs> no, no, not even no, them as no friends. friends no, no friends at all. You got them right here. Nah, it's my boy, man. <laughs> but yeah, so um, I mean, we'll, uh, talk to the people. Let them know what's up next for um, Charlie Vox. Well, right now, this summer, I'm anxious, anxious, anxious to get my mixtape to you guys. So I'm really, really excited about that. Um, that's where You Should Let Me Love You will be. Try again. You got another song. I don't even want to premiere that just yet. I'm not even going. I'll just, you know, keep you guys waiting. I'm trying to just get everybody's lips wet for my album. So hold on, hold on, hold on. Your choice of words. Just <laughs> yeah. ah, you trying to get everybody lips wet? <laughs> yeah. I knew that was coming. Yeah. yeah. I want everybody to be Thirsty. salivating. Let's be ready. Yeah. Just ready. Yeah. And guess what? Trying to get them lips wet. You can wet. download it for free. <laughs> I'm just gonna give y'all this music here. You can have yeah. this. You Except for that it. track featuring Rum. <laughs> um, you can find that on iTunes for ninety nine ninety nine. Well, you know it's gonna get played here, bitch. Our cousins, you know, you know it's gonna. But work. it's for a limited nah. time. It'll be free for a limited time. But I def, I just want everybody to just enjoy the music, hear it. I just wanted to, you know, hit your spirit. What? It's called BPMs. Okay. It'll be out in a few weeks. Wow. So yeah. BPM. What does BPM stand for? Oh, I know what it stands for, but I don't know what it stands for well, for you. Be- beats per minute. Beats per minute. Yeah. Okay. Beats per so minute. Every that. minute of my life. Uh, that's dope. That's dope. Yeah, I, I would have never, never thought about that. I, I would have never thought that. That would have never crossed my mind. I learned ever. that in school. No, 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 no. I, I know what it means. I'm talking about. I never. I would never would have thought no, no, of that for a mixtape. <laughs> I'm tired of your hair, bro. Don't, don't, don't do that, son. <laughs> Yeah, I, I would have oh said Black goodness. Planet members. Or <laughs> Black Planet members, y'all in store Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> Go get that. Black Planet. I don't know. Black BP Planet. Mobile, get your gas. Uh, I, don't, I don't know, man. Oh, man. Black people minutes. That means it's coming late, y'all. Black people meet. <laughs> Black people meet. Yeah, Black. Yo, I'll be there uh, in uh, Black People Minutes. <laughs> it's two hours. Come out in December. <laughs> it's a summer. It's a summer uh, mixtape. Supposed to come out. It'll be summer. out. It'll be out next year. Uh, yeah, January. next spring. <laughs> March Madness is dropping in August. Oh my goodness! Turn up. Oh man. Shots fired. Yeah. yeah. Oh man. For real. Yo, yo, yo. For real. My stomach hurts. But if you log on to my website, <laughs> randomactscharlie.com. There's up to date, you know, info, and when you can add me on Twitter. Are we about to wrap up? Because I'll give you guys all that. Yeah, we, we we still we, we doing it okay, right. We, we talking. Right. We talking. We still talking. Then wrapping up a little bit. Go ahead. Do you think? Um. Yeah. So you can follow me on Twitter. Random X Charlie and X is A X. We'll play on words there. So R A N D O M A X O F C H A R L I E. Random X of Charlie. What is the X for? Yeah. A- and you saw well, A X. A X. Exactly. Just. A little play on words black there. People. Oh, so you being ethnic? BPM. Oh, oh. Just being black a people ethnic. shit. Oh, you getting your ethnicity on? Uh, B- BPS. <laughs> BPS. Black people shit. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be acting like. Next mixtape. BPS. 
BPS, yeah, that's BPS. what's up. <laughs> <laughs> um, Copyrights um, solely belong to the uh, terms of rum. <laughs> <laughs> um, we got two questions, two last questions I'm going to take uh, from Bright Eyes again. She said, how did you get the opportunity to sing for Elizabeth High School? Oh, wow. And um, I'm not sure if you want to answer this, but she said, why was Charlie's album pushed back? It says spring 2012. But another site said summer of this year. Bright eyes, you are so observant. I and like what a girl. Why is Bright Eyes doing all of this homework? Yeah, Bright Eyes. Just be a fan, Bright Eyes. Bright Eyes, girl, you can do all the research you want to do. Okay, Word, nah, that's, me on that's Twitter, random ask Charlie. We could just go back and forth. Oh, look at um, that. Get the DM to popping. See, I can answer two questions at the same time. Okay. I was signed to uh, Indie Deal. <laughs> Back in 2000, into 2010, into okay. 2011, mm. it just didn't work out creatively. You just kind of just didn't see eye to eye creatively. Okay. And that's actually when I began to perform at Elizabeth High School. Okay. And they asked me to come back this year. Nice. They do an obes uh, obesity initiative uh, just before the summer so mm -hmm. that the kids can kind of, you know, won't be sitting around all summer. But you know, they can get in, start moving. But it's start off with the Beyonce Let's Move campaign. <clears throat> they so, might not want to be out, out in Elizabeth. Well, yeah, I mean, yeah, you got to be careful. Um, but that's how I started performing at Elizabeth High School, which I love going to that school. There's always a, a lot of good energy there. Yeah, um, And what what was the second question? Something um, about... Yeah, about uh, the wider oh, okay, yes, Things release. I Never Said. That is an album that never saw the light of day. There are a few songs that are from that album. And you never know, you might you might hear a few songs and okay. they might resurface. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, definitely. Yes. They knew to the people that didn't hear it. Yeah. That's right. Absolutely. They Absolutely. still knew. So that's why you may see conflicting dates because I was in another deal, you know. So this whole random acts of Charlie moment is definitely a reinvention. So I'm excited about that. Nice. So, yeah. so. Well, it's a great interview. This was awesome. Thank you, you guys so much. I think so. No I think so. He just yeah. clap it up. And, <laughs> he looked to the side and everything like, clap it I up, think clap so. It up for that, clap it up for that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Tomorrow, so. <laughs> exclusively on 15mofe.com on the homepage. Definitely. Brand new. Wonder's Cousin. Yes, brand Charlie brand new. Vox video will be out yes. for Vox Try Friday. Again. again. Yes. Yeah. Try yes. again from Wonder Cousin. Yep, 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 yep. And we're going to have it Which on the homepage. The one that looks like him. His cousin. Um... <laughs> What's, who's some of the producers that you worked with? Well, actually, I'm a producer. So nice. uh, wow. the conglomerate is my production team with mm -hmm. Curtis Richardson and a few of our other affiliates. Um, I worked you with- You can name them. They probably, they probably <laughs> watching right now. Like, oh, she ain't gonna say my name. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've worked with a few people, a few people. Um, Elliot Lee is on my album. He's a producer out of Brooklyn. I also work with D Moet. Mm. Let's see who else. Jeremy Rizumna, who's worked with Macy Gray. Um, who else is on this uh, mixtape here? Oh, that's why you didn't want to name because you didn't want to forget nobody. I, you know what? I, I, I don't. I don't. Tell them that you anyone. love them and that you don't mean yes, to forget them. It's definitely my head, y'all. Right. But you're excited heart, to be so. on Freshman Mondays. Absolutely. You know, let them know that. And I'm going to come back for another 15 minutes. Nice. Fame. Yeah. Yes, so yes. I can name everybody then. You know, write How it down. Write I'm going I'll make sure I write it down. Have it right Boy, here. that's <laughs> family <laughs> trait. Boy, <laughs> that's family arrogance. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> you got to write down your stylist too. Who who, do, who does that? Oh, I'm, I styled this moment. Too. You just you just be doing that. I did this today. Yeah, that, that, that's what's up. That's but what's up. I do have a stylist though. Can I give her a shout out? Yeah, please. Hi, do. Yanni. Yannick Joseph. Yanni. Hey, Yanni. Yeah, yeah. I might need you for some things, Yanni. <laughs> Style a nigga up. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> For that parade, though, yeah. right? For that parade. parade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not a Puerto Rican Day parade passed already. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That, that other parade. Only one I was considering. <laughs> <laughs> or the nigga day parade. I might I might look into that. The N-word parade. That's what yeah. I'm going to call it. The N-word. I might pass on that. African parade. We gonna, no, we're going to call it going. new. New, new, okay. <laughs> new, new, that's the N-word. Yes. New. New day parade. Yeah, the new okay. day parade. New day parade. No because it's a new day. No yes. new parade. That's what we prayed for. Absolutely. Prayed for a new day. Yes, we did. That's what it is. The N-word <laughs> day parade. Yes. New day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> follow us on Instagram at Fresh Air E-N-T. Uh, follow us also at 15MOFE Radio. And, um, you can follow me at f 2 Rum. On Instagram. When you follow us on f at 15 MOFE Radio or at Fresh Air ENT, you will be able to find me, Rum, and Key, and Rail, and Charlie. Shout out to Charlie. Shout out yeah. to our engineer HD in the building. Yeah. Taking these pictures. Word up. 
Um, all independent artists, make sure you send us your music. Yeah. Freshmanradio at gmail.com. Yeah. You know, if you want it to be considered Not fresh five. man, fresh men. Fresh men with an E. And we men. Fresh Radio. Men. Fresh men with an E. Yeah, fresh men. Radio at gmail.com. If you want it to be considered, it be aired on our show. Yeah. All yeah. right. So, last words to the people. Yeah. Oh, last words to the people. Okay. Random acts of Charlie.com. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter as well, Random Acts Charlie. You can find me on Instagram. I love taking pictures. I update them every day. Random Acts of Charlie. And remember, Acts is with an A X. So it's R A N D O M A X O F C H A R L I E. Look for BPMs. It's coming out in a few weeks. And try again. BPMs. The video is going to be exclusive here tomorrow. Tomorrow. 15mofe.com. Yes. And we're about to close out with the record, but I'm putting you on the spot. Okay. Because you just did a little jingle. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> right now, <laughs> I need you to, if you, right now, somebody offered you the moment that you needed mm-hmm. to take off in your career, mm-hmm. what would you sing, sing for them right now? Okay. Go. <clears throat> Let's pretend it's me. Hold on. You got to look at me and stuff. <laughs> I'm going to do the Diddy thing. He's sitting over there. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm, I'm the exec. Oh, okay. I might, I might sign right. you to um, some, some, some big life shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> So hold on, I'm gonna do the Diddy face, and then you gotta sing. <laughs> I'm walking for cheesecake, right? Okay, this is a song called Heal. Just actually. say the song. Okay, just sing. <laughs> Skydiving right now, be falling. No safety net hitting the wall, and tears pouring like heavy rain. Emptiness got me over the edge. Try to quiet all the noises around me. The heartache didn't make it easy. Forget about what we used to share. Wish I could say I didn't care. See, I need some time to heal, heal, heal. Get hold of how I feel, feel, feel. If I want something that's real, real, real. Yeah, I need some time to heal, heal, heal. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. Hold on, right. I gotta keep my Diddy composure. Yeah, that was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the first. Come man. up here at like twelve o'clock. Oh, I see you. Thank you. Studio audience. You got the studio audience. Oh man. Thank you guys. I'm gonna yeah, see you back tough. at twelve o'clock. <laughs> the studio's open. <laughs> that's three thousand five hundred eighty-six thousand. <laughs> <laughs> Fifty mrp dot com. Freshman Monday. Charlie Vox in the building. We see y'all next week, eight to the ten. And right now, we're closing out with... Try again. By Charlie now. Fox. See y'all next week. <laughs> Freshman yeah. Mondays. No new friends, y'all. We out of here. <laughs> we out. Mohawk. <laughs> <laughs> that was so much fun. 15 minutes of fame. Let's go.